Street crew or? Okay. Where we pay? No. Ah. Perfect. Free, which is so cool. Come on, Sri Lanka. Yeah. So if you don't know this guy, he's a super fan of Sri Lanka. You probably see him in a lot of different countries. Hey, I'm Kira, and this is my better half, Maddie. We both decided to leave the UK at the start of 2023 to follow our dreams and go travelling full time. This is our Sri Lanka series. Hello from Gaul. Now you might be wondering, why are we in Gaul for the second time? Or maybe why is Maddie not with me? Well, the simple answer to that is the cricket is on. So we came all the way from Jaffna to Nagombo, all the way down to Gaul to watch the cricket at the Gaul International Stadium. It's Sri Lanka versus Ireland, so let's go and check it out. Are you born? Straight through or? Okay. Where we pay? No. Okay. Ah, perfect. Wow. We definitely don't get that at the Lord's Cricket Ground. Free to enter. I don't know if that's because it's uh, after tea already, so we got here quite late. So it's uh, the last session just starting for all you cricket enthusiasts. So I think that's the reason as to why it's free. So this is what cricket looks like in Sri Lanka, well more specifically Gaul. The stadium is located right near the sea in the famous uh, Gaul Dutch Fort. There's two stands inside the stadium, all with seating which is what you tend to expect in the grounds across the world. There's the grass bank with many of the locals and also where I was sitting, which is free, which is so cool. Come on, Sri Lanka. Yeah. And then you also have the fort walls where some people are watching from outside of the stadium and also it's free. So it's a really nice atmosphere in here. So that is it for day four. Ireland finished the day two wickets down, so it means the fifth day should be very interesting. Sri Lanka will be pushing for the win, and I'd imagine Ireland will be pushing for the draw. But as I was just leaving, I noticed some uh, food places, so I thought, well, I'll have a look and see what it differs to uh, England. Because in England, we get burgers, hot dogs, pies. So let's see what they have in Sri Lanka. So this place here, Kotomi, definitely wouldn't get that back in the UK. I did actually get a drink from here. This is selling water. And then I think I may have noticed like an ice cream uh, stand. Let's go have a look. Yeah, definitely ice cream. Sri Lanka's favorite ice cream. Normally too cold in the UK to try this. And then all the way over here, we have what looks like it's coffee. So I come tomorrow, maybe I take a coffee in the morning. So it's time to find out what young Maddie has been up to while I've been out to cricket. It's busy. It's really busy here. Here she is. What have you been up to, Maddie? It's a lot. You good? Yeah, tired. So we are reunited after the cricket. We're just going to watch the sunset on the fort walls so we will see you tomorrow for day five. We are just on our way into the entrance of the Gaul International Stadium for day five of the test match. Should be a really exciting day today, so I'm looking forward to it. And I've even managed to persuade a little someone to come and join us. How excited are you, Maddie? I mean, I'm not exactly excited. I don't, I'm not a big cricket fan, but I'll come check it out. I do normally like the atmosphere of places like this, so I'll go have a look and then I'll have a day looking around Gaul. And who are you supporting, Sri Lanka or Ireland? Um, Sri Lanka. So since I'm with Maddie, I thought let's take her into the member stand. And it's also free. Sounds like a good party here. So the first session has finished. Ireland are five down. I've just met back up with Maddie. We're just heading for lunch. We're going to our favorite restaurant in the Gaul Fort. They have delicious local food. We're just arriving now. It's called Abacati. I hope it's open. Yeah, I hope it's open too. Oh no, it doesn't look. Maybe it's not open. <laughs> Thank you. 
So I'm here with the Sri Lankan super fan Guyan. What did you make of today's win? Yeah, it was a very good feel like I won the test series to zero. In the last uh, time, I uh, won the last uh, one series and six times in it. Bro, after a long time, Sri Lanka won the test series in Sri Lanka. The Ireland team, uh, the factor is played very well today in it. We got in 80 runs. Sri Lanka for my chance to get the world record. Yeah, he's a pretty good record. He's a first uh, spinner, got uh, seven matches. So, uh, in the world. Yeah. So, if you don't know this guy, he's a super fan of Sri Lanka. You probably see him in a lot of different countries. So, who is your man of the match today? Yeah, I think Baba is a good baller. Yeah, yeah. He got five wickets the last. Yeah. But Sri Lanka second he got uh, two wickets. He got very well. But yeah. So, if you following cricket around the world, you'll definitely see this guy. Really cool. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. So that is it for the test match. Sri Lanka take a comfortable win which is really surprising considering Ireland scored nearly 400 in the first innings. But it was a really cool experience to watch some test cricket at the Gold Stadium. And it was also really nice today I managed to meet Gaitan, which is a Sri Lankan super fan. And it was nice to have a chat with him. He tends to travel all over uh, the world of Sri Lanka. He's actually sponsored by them. Um, but yeah, it was really enjoyable experience watching the cricket and so cheap as well. To think that I got him for free uh, the beer was only 550 rupees. So if I'm back in Gaul for another test match, I would definitely attend. So now it is time to say goodbye to all you lovely people. Make sure you are subscribed and we will see you in the next one. Three, two, one, Ayubo and Fanel.